Hi, this is Russell Longcore from PortableOnlineBusiness.com and at PortableOnlineBusiness.com we show you how to have a, a business of your own at your home, run from the comfort of your home or anywhere else you can get an internet connection and even, uh, even as a retiree and that's the reason I'm coming to you today because you were clicking around the, the internet and you were clicking on the words retirement investing. Now when I see that kind of a thing I'm thinking that someone who clicks retirement investing is already retired uh, or the chances are good that you're al already retired and you're looking for the best kinds of investments to put your money into while you're investing or while you're retired uh, so that you can uh, so that you can gain an income from that money uh, now here's the problem you're a baby boomer baby boomers are the people that were born between 1946 and 1964 the Census Bureau says that there were 76 million people that were born during that period of time and as of 2011 uh, those people that were born in 1946 started turning uh, uh, they started turning 65 at a rate of 10,000 a day so there's a whole bunch of us that are turning 65 that whole baby boomer generation we are now coming into our retirement years and we're overloading all the systems including the Social Security uh, system. Uh, here's the problem, and let, let me, let, actually let me show you something that, that, that came through this weekend um, at, a, um, at the website for the New York Times, the Sunday New York Times, the fabled great big Sunday New York Times. Well, in their money section this week, <clears throat> they had an article that said, for retirees, this is the headline, for retirees, a million dollar illusion and let me tell you and let me basically tell you what this is they're saying that even a even a retiree today a typical retiree today at 65 years old with a million dollars in their portfolio would likely run through that money before they die here's the quote let me pull a couple quotes for you <clears throat> but by, by the way I'll have the link to the article below so you can read the whole thing <clears throat> here's a here's a pull quote a typical a typical 65 year old couple with a million dollars in tax-free municipal bonds wants to retire they plan to withdraw four percent of their savings a year a common rule of thumb drawdown and that would give them forty thousand dollars a year but under current conditions if they spend that forty thousand a year adjusted for inflation there is a 72 percent probability that they will run through their bond portfolio before they die now think about this Municipal bonds used to be the safest of the safe havens for an investment. If you were looking for capital uh, 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 preservation, if you were just totally looking for safety, the only place that you went was municipal bonds. Many times those municipal bonds were tax-free. But the, the, the uh, New York Times is saying that now, because of the volatility in all the investment markets, bonds, stocks, uh, real estate, I mean, everything you can put your money into is volatile right now because of how Washington is screwing up the economy. Because of the volatility of the entire market, there's nothing safe anymore. And in, even in a situation, even in the safest situation possible, uh, you could still, as a 65 year old, run through and, and be and use all of your money before you die. And um, uh, it says here, uh, with rising life expectancies, many people will have a lot of time. The average 65-year-old woman today can be expected to live to 86. The, uh, a man will live to 84. One, of, one out of 10 people who are 65 today will live past 95, according to the projections of the Social Security Administration. So, so this article is saying that, that you can't do what you used to do. And, and, and here's, the, here's the big problem that we have as baby boomers, and I'll be, night, I'll be 60 in, uh, in August, so I'm right there with you. <clears throat> baby boomers were that 76 million people that were born between 1946 and 1964. And as of 2011, 10,000 people a day are turning 65. So, you know, we distorted all the markets from the time we were born until now. We're continuing to, to distort the markets. And the one we're distorting now is the investment market and, uh, and the Social Security Administration and all the things that go along with retirement. We're distorting the retirement market. We will for the next 19 years. 
And here's the problem. During our lifetimes, during our working years from 25 to 65, there were four economic crashes that vacuumed trillions of dollars out of the American economy and trillions of dollars out of investments just like yours. And you may have experienced that sometime in your life where you saw a nice investment portfolio just, just disappear and there was nothing that you could do about it. Well, how are you going to make up the money? Because you, you, you're out of time. Baby boomers are out of time. We can't go back to being 25 years old and, and have another 30 years of, of, uh, uh, of investing and earning. <clears throat> we're now at a point where we're 20, 25, 30 years tops away from uh, our eventual demise if we kept our health. And, and that's another one of the big complications is that even if you could go back into the workforce, what if your health doesn't allow you to go back into the workforce? Uh, what if you couldn't possibly stand to do some of the menial jobs that are out there right now uh, th that would allow you to make money? So there's an awful lot of the deck stacked against the baby boomers right now. And even if you had a million dollars, you probably would outlive it. So what are the, wh what are the alternatives? Well, there's a, the alternative, one of the alternatives, I'm sure there are some others, one of the alternatives is, is to use the principle of something called equivalent assets. And that's the reason that I'm talking to you today, is that through having a, a, a home business, a portable online business, and uh, something you can do through internet marketing, and we'll show you how, you can build a business that'll throw off the kind of monthly income that uh, will replace the monthly income that you lost in your portfolio. I'll give you an example of that if you'll go to www.portableonlinebusiness.com. Look at the top of the page where you see all the different words that are up there. There are different labels like, <clears throat> like college student and, and teenager and single mom and military, all kinds of different things. Well, you look for the one that says retirees and click on that. And go ahead and read that article that talks about the, the principle of equivalent assets and how you can make up the monthly income that you lost when your investment portfolio went kablooey. So that's what I want for you to. That's what I want you to do today. Go to Portable Online Business. The link is right below. Click on the word retirees. Leave your name and your telephone number, and your email address. Mostly, most important is your email address. And let's start a conversation and talk about how we can help you to recover from financial losses that you've had. So this is Russ Longcore. Thanks very much. I look forward to talking with you. Good luck and goodbye.